for Sister Claire. She would always be in our hearts. A long time ago, in a town called Nazareth, there lived a young woman named Mary and a young carpenter named Joseph. They loved each other very much, and they also loved God very much. Mary was very special because God had chosen her to be the mother of his only son. God sent the angel Gabriel to ask Mary if she would be the mother of God. Mary, you are the chosen one. The angel told her, soon, soon you will have a baby boy that, that will be very special. You must call him Jesus. Soon after the angel's visit, Herod, the ruler of the land, sent a messenger with an order. Everyone must return to the place they were born to pay a special call. Joseph was worried. He was born in a place called Bethlehem. It was a long trip, and Mary's baby was due at any time. Joseph and Mary knew they had to go, and so they went off and prepared for their journey. Joseph walked by her side. It was a very long and dangerous journey. Mary and Joseph were grateful to their faithful donkey who carried her so bravely and so carefully. Mary Thank said, you, little donkey. You're welcome. It took many days to reach Bethlehem. And when they arrived, Mary was very tired. They had to find somewhere to stay, but the town was so crowded with lots of other travelers, and every inn they went to was full. Eventually, seeing how tired they both looked, one innkeeper took pity on them. I have no room at the inn, but you can stay at this, at this stable. It is where my animals are kept. It's warm and dry. Thank you. You're welcome. Later that night, Mary gave birth to Jesus. She wrapped him in strips of cloth and laid him in the manger. Let's move a little closer to the baby. We might wake up the baby. <coughs> the baby is already awake. Nearby on a hillside, some shepherds were watching over their sheep. And as they did so, a very bright light came shining into the sky. The light was sent by God. And one shepherd named Hunter said, Do not be afraid, we have good news. The Son of God has been born. You will find him in a manger in Bethlehem. <laughs>
shining in the sky. They knew that this meant that the great ruler had been born. The three wise men decided to go find the baby and thinking that the baby would be in a palace, they went to see King Herod who was very angry upon hearing about the baby Jesus. He thought the newborn king might take away his throne. The three wise men decided to follow the star to the stable in Bethlehem where they found Jesus lying in a manger. night many people came to visit the baby Jesus even first graders visited the baby and brought him small gifts and presents ladies and gentlemen boys and girls let us not forget what Christmas is all about let us not forget that it is Jesus's birthday this Christmas let us try to keep a clean heart so that Jesus can be born there too we ask him now and always to be the center of our lives as we sing our last song for you, Away in a Manger. Merry Christmas, Assumption families. Merry Christmas! 